Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Udetu Tulu, if this is your first time here. In today's video, we are tackling a big question that a lot of you have been asking, which is, should I do, should I go to a university or a fac actually, or should I do an Ausbildung, which is a vocational training that we do here in Germany? There's a lot to consider when it comes to what to do. And today I'm going to break it all down. We're going to talk about the pros, the cons, and key differences. Plus, I'll touch on some other factors that you may not have thought about, like work-life balance, job security, and even international opportunities. So make sure you watch this video to the end so you can have a clear idea of what fits you best. Let's start with an Ausbildung. What is an Ausbildung? It's a hands-on apprenticeship program where you're trained for a specific job or a trade. It's practical and the best part is you get paid while you're learning. Most Ausbildung programs take two to three years and by the end you are ready to dive into the workforce with a recognized qualification. Whether it's becoming a nurse, an electrician, a business professional, marketing professional, or even a software developer, you can find an Ausbildung that suits your interest. On my channel, I have videos about completing a vocational training in Germany, so be sure to check them out after watching this video. Now, what's it like to study at a Fachhochschule or a university? Um, both universities offer theoretical education. Universities would focus mainly on research and deep theoretical knowledge. So they are great for people interested in careers like medicine, law or academia if you want to become a profession, uh, professor. If I actually is a bit different because while you get solid academic background, the programs are more focused on practical applications. Even your professors have practical experience in the professional office setting. Courses are often shorter with compulsory internships or projects that provide real world um, experience. What are the advantages of an Ausbildung? First, of course, and foremost, you earn while you learn. In an Ausbildung, you start earning money right away. Once you start your Ausbildung, that month you're getting paid. This is awesome, especially if you want to avoid student loans and want to get financial independence early. Um, secondly, there's also the ease of entry into the job market. In just two to three years, you're considered a fully qualified professional for a specific job. And by the time university students are graduating, you already have a few years of work experience. You get practical experience from day one. If you're not a fan of sitting in a classroom or long lectures, or for example, you're even a practical learner, an Ausbildung is all about doing, not just learning. So you spend most of your time on the job, building real skills that you can use once you're done with your house building. Completing an Ausbildung provides you with a high job security because a lot of companies that offer Ausbildung opportunities would provide jobs to their apprentices as soon as they finish. Some even offer you a job before your graduation, right? This means job security is even higher compared to university graduates who might have to struggle, send applications, complete their advantages. There's bound to be disadvantages. What are the disadvantages of an Ausbildung? Firstly, there's limited career flexibility. Once you're trained for a specific job, it might be hard to switch fields later without you doing further education. So if you're not 100% sure that you want of what you want to do long term, then an Ausbildung might feel like a bit limiting or constricting. So maybe consider a degree that gives you the flexibility to change careers over time. There is a lower earning potential long term. Um, with an Ausbildung, you start earning earlier, but university graduates tend to have higher salaries over time, especially in fields like business, engineering, and tech. So if you want to be a high income earner, then perhaps you want to consider what kind of you know program that you want to do for certain trainings um, they are more useful in specific regions for example if you train as a carpenter or a mechanic job av availability might depend on local demand but if you have completed a university degree you can you you can get international career opportunities which i would dive more into shortly what are the advantages of completing a degree at a university or a fac actually. There is greater career flexibility. Without a doubt, a degree from a university or a fac actually would open more doors, especially if you want to switch fields or take on different roles in the future. The <clears throat> versatility of a university degree often means you're not locked into one career path. You can change careers as you go. 
There is also a higher earning potential, although you spend more years studying, university graduates generally earn higher salaries in the long run. This is especially true for careers in medicine, engineering or finance. Um, your degree is also internationally recognized and opportunities are open internationally. So if you want to work abroad, you don't have to think twice about it. A degree can be a major advantage. However, some degrees like law or architecture might require some local accreditations, but a lot of other fields are open to global opportunities. Additionally, universities offer exchange programs, giving you the chance to study abroad and network internationally. I've spoken about that on my channel as an avenue to get a scholarship through the Erasmus program. So if you are interested in that, you might want to scroll down a bit down the, my previous videos to see more about getting a scholarship or completing an internship. Personal development and networking is also an important factor and an important advantage that completing a degree offers because the university does not just offer you education, it also is space for personal growth. You meet people from different backgrounds, you take part in extracurricular activities, you build networks that can help in your future career. At a FACOC Shule, you also get these opportunities, but it's a more practical and career-focused environment. Now, what are the disadvantages of, a, of completing a degree, going to a university or a University of Applied Sciences? It takes longer to complete a degree. Um, degrees take anywhere from three to six years. Um, depending on the program that you're doing and during that time you're likely not earning like a steady income um, This make this might make things a bit tough If you're interested in completing an internship during your studies check out this linked video It will be in the description box as well depending on your field Just having an, a degree might not be enough You need internships extracurriculars and networking to stand out which can be stressful in comparison to an Ausbildung, um, a degree is more theor theoretical and less practical in, in a traditional setting. Some programs at universities don't focus enough on real-world applications, and which can leave you feeling a bit unprepared for the actual job market. If I actually bridges this gap with more practical courses and compulsory internships, so um if you're looking to complete a degree perhaps you want and you and you want more practical experience then maybe a fac actually is the best fit for you what other factors should you consider when it comes to making this huge decision that could greatly impact your life you want to look at work-life balance doing an house doing often means that you have a better work-life balance early on in your career you're working set hours and learning on the job but you're not dealing with exam stress or the pressure of juggling multiple projects like you would in a university however if you want to complete a degree at a university there's more flexibility in managing your time yes it might be overwhelming but it's not impossible yeah of course long-term job security both an Ausbildung and a university degree would offer you job security, but it depends on your industry. An Ausbildung is great for industries in, with stable demand, like skilled trades or in healthcare. I have a video which I just posted last week um, with um, someone who completed an Ausbildung. You might want to check that out after watching this video. Industries like tech, business or research, a university degree would offer better long-term prospects especially if you if you aspire to be in a leadership position in the future one major advantage of university education is the focus on lifelong learning if you're interested in personal growth or pursuing leadership roles later in life having a degree makes it easier to return to study or pursue a master's an mba or specialized courses with an ausbildung you may need to retrain or study again to switch careers right so having said all that which one do you think is better for you i think it comes down to your goals and priorities if you're looking to get into the workforce quickly earn money right away or you prefer hands-on learning then perhaps an house doing would be the best fit for you on the other hand if you want more career options potential for um, higher salaries and the ability to work internationally 
then studying at a university or a factory would be worth the extra time and effort. Plus, you have more flexibility later on in life when you want to change careers. Um, whichever route you choose, remember that there's no one size fits all. Just because everyone is um, wants to do an Ausbildung does not mean you should do an Ausbildung. Your friends want to go to university, then you also want to go to university. You should pick the option that aligns with your strengths, interests, and the lifestyle you want to create long term. Let me know in the comment section what you're thinking, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Ciao.